or a Dagron, if you will. Tarkin? Penetrating sword. Mm hmm. Not like those other swords. Pull two of these guys. It's not great. You've met the triple triad. Not gonna like spear bro here. Why not? Nope. He does a lot of damage. And he does scraping, I... isn't he? Yep. Yep. That's that's the I actual issue. I had to go back and repair my equipment like five or six times before I beat him. Yeah. Why is full moon grass not? Okay. He blocked my sword even though he was mid swing. This is a good meme. Okay. Uh, what if. No, that's not gonna work. Okay. And this thing breaks quick. And does a billion damage. Sweet. Okay. So that's really, really bad. In fact, I would go out on a limb and say that is a design mistake. Mm-hmm. How I pulled the archer, but none of the other guys. There we go. You want to? Are you fucking gonna come over here? Fucking weird game. Yeah, their their aggro is very odd. Now I don't even know where the other guy is, which is the problem. Otherwise, I'd shoot him with the bow. The uh, third guy? Yeah, sword guy. Because he was running around towards me, but now he's gone. Oh, yeah. He should spawn in on the left, or I mean on the right. Yeah, he did, but now he's not fucking there, because he's probably caught on some shit. Okay, yep. here's what we're doing. Hopefully this works. All the way out. I'm back. that bounding box done. 
No, it didn't. Is there a way to aim with uh, spells? I'm guessing not. Nope. I mean, you could probably do some janky thing with the monocular. I guess this is how we're gonna approach this bow. whole thing. Like, you could probably aim with the bow and then shoot your magic. Well, I got one of them. Basically, I just have to reset the whole fucking zone, I guess, because they're not going to let me engage anything. Okay. Uh, in that case... Did you get his loot, though? Uh, pretty sure I did. Clicked on him. I don't know, remember when he drops, but... It was a penetrator sword? Probably. Okay, so he actually didn't aggro despite what it kind of looks like. What the fuck? Okay. He's super bugged. He's literally... <laughs> Is he killing the guy? Wait. No way, right? I... No? There's gotta be no way. No, he's just shooting. I was going to say, that'd be completely insane. We have to rewrite the lore if that happens. having a really hard time keeping aggro to me. A questionable time, I would say. Uh, ooh, ooh. What? Uh, okay. <laughs> Is that supposed to prepare you for rubber banding? <laughs> I don't know what that was. 
The new I've speed tech. I've never seen that. Disseminate it wisely, Alucard. It's the new speed tech. He's building up momentum through the arrows. <laughs> Either that or he was failing a glitch. Constantly. Hello. Good shot. Sup? I've obtained the white bow. What the hell was I watching at first? I think I think he shot himself out of his bow. Souls games, ladies and gentlemen. Now, if Souls. only we could figure out how it worked and have the player do it. I mean, I just kind of ejected myself from a piece of wood. Ooh. Maybe that's kind of what happened, but it zoomed him straight ahead. Like, maybe that's what yeah. was happening, was he was caught in something, and then when I broke it, it just slingshot him or something? I don't fucking know, dude. It's super bizarre. I think that's... I think a similar thing happens in Dark Souls 2 that's very abusable. It's like you just get yourself caught in a place you shouldn't be, and you can just build up momentum, and then launch yourself across the map. Sounds like old school zipping. Get pitching yep. between enough pixels. Yep. Pixels. Alright, nerd. Please stop nerding. Okay. Alright, I have discovered the tactic that I will use against this Cadillac of men. And it is flail my sword constantly. Scar break. What? Ugh, okay. Didn't work out so well there, but we have our strat. CVHD though. I also have another idea, which is these rotten arrows probably are pretty good against this guy. At mm -hmm. least if I hit him initially. <laughs> However, he's not ticking down. No. So I guess you need to build it up. Well, it needs to be built up. Huh? We can't poison with just one arrow. A bad game. Wow. Did that work? Did it? No, dude, I still can't hear Turbo. Probably an improvement, to be honest. <laughs> yeah, this is how we're doing this. Look at how much of a what the hell's wrong with this court guy. these days? <laughs> Look at how much of a hero I am, Alucard. Yeah, there you go. You found the Dark Souls strategy. You found the bad game strat. That's. It's kind of how you use NPCs. Mm. <sighs> A lot of times you can pull them like way past their bounding box and then stand in front of them as they try to run back to it and they don't do anything and they don't push you. So, have I built up the poison yet?
having a really hard time understanding what to do here. What a great video game. I don't know what I got myself into. <laughs> I need to build it up because I haven't hit him with every arrow, but I've hit him with like four or five of them. Yeah, so I think Dark Souls does a be does this better, at least on the player side, to where you have a bar that, as you take poison damage, it starts to fill up and it doesn't proc until it's full. And the same thing goes for enemies. It's the reason why you don't just instantly get poison when you go into the swamp. It takes a second. Also, a lot of those arrows are hitting his shield. Yeah, I know. Ooh, holy arrow. Shoot through him. It's also impossible to aim in this game. I don't know if you've picked up on that from my multiple misses. It's very weird. I really didn't want to fight like this, but I also don't want to spend the whole night breaking shit and getting souls to recover it, so. And if it's a one-time enemy, then whatever. Got him. All right. I'm the big hero. Heroism is legendary. But I can't pick the disc because it would overburden me. I I think it's the okay, shield. Because now I can just put on the Herculean ring, pick it up, and then go back to town. Mm -hmm. Power shield. So the real question if Dark Phantoms got killed off, then how come Dark Phantom Mind Flayers don't? Wow. Think they just do that? Shitty have a game. discrepancy? Why do you play these bad games, Alucard? Guilty pleasure. <laughs> I backseated Wesker super hard in Bloodborne. I told him that he should hit the enemy and not die. Damn it, Ice Team, and do your job. Careful, Turbo, that's how you get banned. This game has a bad habit of making the enemies past a boss more difficult than the boss itself. Like, why weren't these guys bosses? Because they didn't have the cool design. Easy, buddy. will have a female lead. So basically, they just wanted to make a heavy metal Metroid. Not Doom. Gotcha. Then again, the movie they made wasn't Doom either, so I mean... What are you gonna do, right? They 
just wanted Doom, but with Samus Aran as the main character. My backup, if that didn't work, by the way, was like trying to push, break his guard, backing out of that. Problem is, is I didn't feel like I could race him effectively since so Spear is such a faster attack animation. So, I don't know how that would have actually played out. So maybe I can get him to do the bad pathing. Nope, I can't get him to do the bad pathing. Wait, maybe? Pull. Yeah. Almost. He's a little smart. This is around the time I stopped using Adjudicator because I wanted to parry the knights. It's just easier. They do a lot of damage, I will give you that. Ooh. Look, it's a dagger on. Okay, that's the blue one? That shoots fire, I guess. Maybe. Hard to tell. I think that's a blue dragon. He did just roast the entire bridge, seemingly. He seems to do that very aggressively. What if I do this? Okay. Okay, that hit him. That didn't exactly do gangbusters on damage either. Hmm. Can I fall off somewhere? Also, I probably should swap shields. Uh, Dark Silver, I think, is my best shield for... Yeah, I've got my best... does it very aggressively. That official wasn't taking damage from the fire. That's supposed to be the case? Uh, probably. That or the fat official is what killed you and the hitboxes were just wonky. I like, wasn't think there. he swung. <laughs> no, he definitely swung. A second time? Uh, maybe. At least once. That is correct, Dark Souls 32016. I hear 
my Discord friendo has answered a question. Correct. Perhaps the only question that really mattered. Ow. The uh, real answer is the what questions we asked along the way. Fucking shit. Okay. Fucking shit. Uh, okay. I just... I couldn't see well enough to parry. I wanted to, but everything was fucking in the way. I got counterattack for 80% of my life. Nice. I'll be back. So, should I give the rule of thumb for parries? Uh, I that think they're bad they... and they don't work correctly. Or they should work or not work as a binary and not as a glancing blow system that makes zero sense. I'm pretty sure that that's how they work. No. But, maybe. Well, I mean, that guy has hit me for way more damage than it did when I attempted a parry, so I'm glancing, or I'm guessing there's a type of glancing state of parry. Because there isn't, it doesn't seem like there's a glancing state of blow, because every time I've been fucking hit, I've been hit. Well, your parry just whiffed entirely. Why did it make the sound of metal connecting with metal, then? That wasn't the same as getting hit. It hit your shield, which is sound thing, but it's not the same as a parry. So it's bad. Gotcha. The, the rule of thumb for demons at dark is that you, you parry their hand instead of their weapon. At least that's, that's, that's a better hell. idea for the timing as well as the spacing. That makes no sense, and that's bad. <laughs> and it get, they should it, feel bad. Well, see, the fix is in Dark Souls 2. The oh, parries in Dark Souls 2 are garbage. Excuse me? Alright, well, I guess he's still alive. No. What? Right. He has a sliver, but it's just kind of dumb. But he burst into flames. Well, that's just the effect of his sword. Burn damage as well. It burns him with fire. Yeah, it's just that makes zero sense contextually and mechanically that you would parry their hand, and it makes zero sense that it would hit my shield but not count as a parry. Because that's the thing I'm just... fucking parrying oh. with, is my shield. Yes. <laughs> mm. And I wasn't blocking through it. Like, my parry was out there. I wasn't holding block afterward. Okay. Now that I have, I figured fighting him on the stairs was better because, like I said, I was constantly fighting the camera to be able to see him in there, and I didn't want to pull him into the side hall because that seemed like kind of a losing proposition as well. Uh, okay, let's see. Maybe I can do this instead. Now that I actually kind of see that guy. Oh, there's actually multiple fat officials. So why was I able to hit the... Why didn't the fire hit the other one? Super bizarre. Yeah, here's the real question. 
questions. Can I snipe this guy? I'm guessing no, but... Yeah, those crenellations are solid. There's no way. Yeah. Okay. I get that. No. Okay. So that means I basically have to commit. Okay. Uh, so that time I got hit by it. Hmm. Hi. You came out of here a lot faster. Why did you come here so quickly? Please don't die from this. Okay. Alright. I suppose I could have my shield up as I do this as well. Actually gonna evac. Okay. 